previously, probably before someone died. Why? Hannibal, why? What are you doing? Okay, time for some Bavai's action, I guess. Ah! Oh, he's very dead. Ah! He's very dead. He's very dead. I'm what? Sorry. Uh, Clever uh, mode. Uh, and now, let's continue where we left off. Let's try this again. So this time I've equipped a wind tome on Arthur. So we'll see who Hannibal goes for now. I just hope Arthur will be okay. Yeah. Max okay. was like, I wanna, I wanna injure Hannibal, and then he equipped Orphe with an armor slayer and then attacked by accident. So that was, uh, that was some clever mode by Max. That was, that was clever <laughs> mode indeed. That was, but... that was not focus mode. That was clever mode. Yeah, cause oh shit. Cause here's the thing. Like, I I do think he retreats if you uh if you injure him. But I maybe on clever mode he doesn't run away. If I don't know. I it is true. I have very little experience on clever mode. I just think it's a dumb excuse. For <laughs> <laughs> but like I've never seen him do that before, and this is the first time I play clever mode. So you gotta admit there might be something to it, right? Maybe, but you know, a broken clock twice a day, that kind of shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, you just hate clever mode. You just don't want me to be right. I just hate you. Come, okay. All right, let's okay, see. If don't Arthur crit, is don't crit. crit. Don't crit. Don't crit. Don't crit. Adam crit, crit. Whatever. Don't uh, crit. Don't crit. Don't crit. Don't crit. Don't, don't crit. Don't crit. Yes. Mm -hmm. ah! <laughs> <laughs> hey, Adam. If you want someone else to survive, maybe you should set this set this a good example. Ah! Hey, you got gold, congrats. Be right back. Fine. Okay, now, guys, now, what I do, okay, so, now. Oh, I am Mr. Charm. I have not placed anyone in range of Hannibal whatsoever. So let's see what he does now, if he still retreats or whatnot, like, he shouldn't. Makes you wonder why we didn't do this to begin with. Ah, uh, because we wanted to kill the bow armor, but I realized it didn't really. It may have. It may end up costing us a turn because self's like one tile further to the right. So if he just doesn't reach the castle now, that's like a turn wasted. But honestly, we can. We can. Afford Whatever. It. We can afford it. Plus, you have to wait for like a oh. fucking year. For, he still doesn't yeah. retreat. Yeah. Oh well. So right now, I think our best bet is to see if we can reduce him to half health. But even then, I'm not even sure if he's gonna retreat because this might be a clever mode thing. Oh, well, you should just try it out, I guess. Yeah, no reason not to, because you don't have to go in his range. You just have to, like, chip him from range and then run away with someone. Maybe you should have kept the Paragon ban on Johavir. Uh, I don't know. I like the okay. Adeo Eris. Yeah, he's not getting a lot from these. Does I think Johavir is going to kill, like, this guy on an enemy phase, and then maybe, like, two more this turn. That's going to be it for, like, almost half the chapter, if not the old, whole chapter. Yeah, he's not really going to do He's not going to do a whole lot. Maybe you should put him like on a castle that's assaulted by the Draco Knights, or like, somehow get him in range of like an entire swarm of them. Then maybe he will be able to do something. You know, we could just turn off his animations and give him a hand axe, and then just give him chip XP. <laughs> yeah, that worked really well in chapter seven, remember? Or chapter eight? Actually. Oh right, they didn't attack him, did they? Oh no, uh, they did. Was, they did. One of the last knights that didn't reach him, I think. That yeah. The so they had better alternatives than attacking a guy with like 20 defense. So I think what we'll do now is we'll set up a dance. I think we'll Leaf will get to shoot one of them down with a silver bow. So you can do that while the... talking to Atena, too. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but I can include him in the dance. Yeah, sure. He doesn't need so... the XP, though. But yeah, you need to dance for him anyway, right? Because he doesn't make it on his own. I mean, is it so bad a thing if he kills a single guy? No, it's not. It's fine. I mean, apparently, the XP, the XP rank is now like completely trivialized, so you can just do whatever you want now. I'm not saying it's completely trivialized. I'm just saying we can have a little fun. I love how you always like like whenever we're like roasting each other, you're always like <laughs> we're so bad at reacting to each other. We always get like sound slightly upset whenever we're like talking to each other, just shit talking. <laughs> yeah, I just I, I I just I don't know. You're dumb. Okay. Hey, anyway, I killed him. Uh, Faval should probably be another one. Oh yeah, for sure. Uh, oh no. Well, shucks. Whoops. Yeah, if only you could shove him, hey. That'd be. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait. Oh, wait a you minute. wanna warp him? I warp and then move down. I think that might work. One. Wait. Uh -huh. One, two, three, four, five. What's this move? Well, it doesn't matter. He can reach every tile you want him to, right? Yeah, can't I he? guess. Oh, we can. No, no, you're right. You can warp him. You're right. You can. I think. Because it's like one, two, three, four, five. No, one, he reaches the one... same tile. Yeah, he does. Mm-hmm. All right, rip. 
Oh well, rip. We'll oh find, well. We'll find someone else. It's okay. There it's we go. That's, that's, a, that's a very dead Vyvern right there. It's the very. only thing Awakening of Faith did right. It's like letting you, showing you overkill damage. Yeah, right? That's <laughs> actually kind of funny. Alright, so we'll dance. Uh, do, 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 do. Lester can be part of this as well. You gonna break the killer bow? Yeah. Why not use the iron bow then? Like, this guy still needs gold, right? Does he? I don't know. He's level 21. Mm. I don't think he has 80k yet, does he? Maybe. We'll see. Uh, and also, then why we'll... did you not move him like left of Favol? Why not? Oh, right, because I can attack here. It's okay, yes. I'll kill them all anyway. There we go, I might as well get Julian on this. <laughs> why not? I guess. There's three, but there's three Draco Knights left. I'm gonna kill them all. Sure, even if you don't, their their equipment is Iron Sword and Javelin. It's not yeah. the most threatening thing. Anymore. Did she just, she, just get an she, empty level? She up? got a blank level up. That was uh, a, that was indeed a blank level. I wonder if her magic and res are caps. I think so. <laughs> I think actually fa Patty will kill her. I think. Uh, I didn't see how much HP they started with, but if it's 50, then yeah. Oh. Nope. Oh no. It's, uh, apparently it's like 47. Aw. Yay, hey. money. Yay. <laughs> I don't know who to give this to anymore. I guess Hannibal's <laughs> gonna need some gold. Yeah, and, Hannibal's uh, actually gonna need to go through the arena. And Kirpra as well. Mm -hmm. Carp is that what you say? I just say Corporal. I don't know. Just call him Carpet, I can guess. He can he talk and then attack? He can attack and then talk. If you want to. Yeah, I want to. I, I want to on it, but yeah. <laughs> the Silver Bow is his like, personal weapon, I've heard. Okay, Chaz. <laughs> I don't even know where that meme comes from. It's just a strain thing. I don't know. It's just a jersey thing. Wait! Please, my sister, stop it! Patty! Your, your, Patty! <laughs> your sister? Who are you? And why do you think calling me your sister is a good idea? <laughs> Wait, no, I wanted to screenshot that. No. Oh. I am Leaf of House Leonster. Leaf? Oh, I see. The famous priest Leaf, is it? In case it wasn't obvious, and evidently it wasn't, I'm Altena, daughter of Travant. Listen to me, Altena. Your true parents are Quan and Etlin, whom Travant slew 17 years ago. You vanished in Travant's attack, and so did Gabog, the sacred Earthlands of Leonster. Which, I might add, is the very lands resting in your hand as we speak. Only a true heir of House Leonster can wield Gabog. What? What are you talking about? Are you seriously trying to claim my real father as my father's arch en enemy? It, that could never be. It mustn't. Look into my eyes. Look! <laughs> if anything can prove the truth of my words to you, it will be my eyes. Please, my sister. Fine, what is this? I know you're lying, but I can't bring myself to doubt you anymore. Altana! Wait, I must speak with father. I need to confirm this. Bye. <laughs> and she just transcends time and space. No, this is what this is how much move Dragonites have in this game, don't you remember? Right. <laughs> Altana! Oh, you have got to be joking. Why, 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 why did you abandon your post for the second time in as many days? My apologies, father, but I have an urgent question to ask you. Are you my father? Or was my father really King Quan? Fah! I see you found that at last. Hey! Well, <laughs> I knew you'd say that. Well, I suppose it was only a matter of time before this day came. It's true, Quan did indeed sire you, but what difference does that make now? It doesn't change it was I who raised you. <laughs> Conquest so, versus birthright? Kaga yeah. did it first. <laughs> <laughs> so you... you murdered my parents. Father. Yeah, <laughs> I suppose I did. Quan and Ethelin died by my hand. Do you take issue with that? War is hell, Altena. War claims lives. Warring now won't change a thing. Gah, how dare you! How dare you mislead me all these years, father! No, Travance! That's enough, Altena. Get out of my way, Arion. This man dies here and now, and nobody can stop me, not even you. I cannot allow this. If you dare to turn on father, then you'll have me to contend with first. Wait, wait! I can't fight you, Arion. I could never... It's too late for you to stand down now. Farewell, Altena. Arion! You didn't just kill her, did you, Arion? You know, you didn't need to go quite so far. Ugh, no matter. I'm going to join the fray, Arion. I suppose there's little choice now. You're in charge of defending the castle. Understood, father. I'll entrust the spear to you, and with it, the future of Tracia. Hold on a moment. This is Gungnir. What is the meaning of this? Do you intend to fight without it? Unless, father, you can't be... I'm, I am. Frankly, Arion, I've had enough. Tracia is yours to do with as you see fit. But we don't need to be hated by their kind. Are you seriously suggesting I should seek a truce, father? No, never! To comply with the rebels now would be unthinkable. As I said, Tracia is yours. Do as you see fit. All I ask is that you find a way to liberate Tracia from their suffering. Farewell, Arion. Father! 
So this is like the one sort of like morally gray moment that Travant gets that kind of like redeems him a little bit. A little bit. He's still a douchebag though. And uh, yeah, to all the people complaining about him not having the Gungnir and heroes, this is why. <laughs> it actually made sense to give him a Silver Lance. I know you're salty about it, but it actually is like very, it's very faithful to the lore. I completely um, forgot about that. Also, yeah, he came with he came with a sil he came with a silver lance and heroes, and people went so crazy about it. They were like, "You should have to go there." It's like, no, he he came with a silver lance. It's actually very, it's accurate. Like, but on the other hand, though, like, not to defend heroes or anything, or like care about heroes or anything, but there is also appearances of Trevor where he has the Gungnir, so it would oh, be yeah, yeah, viable yeah. to give it to him. Yeah, yeah, no, no, they they just didn't want, didn't want to give us a free unit with the Gungnir. That's <laughs> uh, pursuit in the hill of advantage. She's kind of scary. You can't shoot. You can't shoot him down, but like Sadie can kill him with like a window easily enough because yeah. he has no rest. So I think Leaf can also one round him with like a brave bow. <laughs> can I just have all these renewal bands, please? That'd be great. <laughs> Switch them all, drop it, and get like twenty k gold per viper you kill. That'd be great. Oh, I think actually there's going to be one viper. Yeah, there's always one you can't kill, which is annoying. Always two. There are never more, never less. Yeah. Bonk. Yeah, wow. I didn't need to use the killer bow. <laughs> There we go, yeah, because there's no longbows in this game. I'll just, like, put him at guard duty or something, I suppose. I, I mean, this guy can't kill any of my guys in one shot, so it's not like I need to worry, right? No. There we go. So, uh, warp time, I guess. I don't know if you want to warp your dancer home, though. That's kind of far away from where you want her to be in, isn't it? Where do no, we want the dancer? Where do, where do uh, we want the dancer to be? I don't know, maybe at the starting point is fine, because you're going to warp people towards another castle soon. So I'm pretty sure Selif will reach the castle. Yeah, it, w it wouldn't have mattered, I think. Yeah, it's uh, fine. There. So here's the question, though. What do we do with Hannibal? Because I'm not even sure if he's going to retreat anymore. Well, I'm still... Strange as it is, I might be still be in favor of, like, reducing his health and seeing if that helps. Does it help with the captain, at least, in that chapter, right? So it, there's, like, an instance of it happening before a maddening or... Maddening? maddening. Clever mode. <laughs> I can't even say clever mode because I hate it so much. Yeah. Um, Looks like all his troops are dead now. There should be some kind of a difference. I really think so, but he is a little suicidal, apparently. Maybe, like, on clever mode, you need to kill everyone before he retreats? I don't know. Oh, shit. Wait, what? Ah! That's fine. Maybe you won't attack him. <laughs> okay, who uh, who can, like... S okay, so... Harris with, like, not not the, the thing. Mm -hmm. Nah, that probably doesn't kill a meter. Aris can still, like, he doesn't have crit when he's uh, not holding the missile No, team. he doesn't. He has adept, but, like, with the lance, he should be fine, I think. Yeah, I think so, too. Because he does, like, yeah, even if he procs it twice, that's, like, 40 damage. So, I think this is fine. As long as we keep everyone out of his range, he should go for Aris. Mm-hmm. So the plan uh, is to just have him fight you in any phase until he's below half health and then hope he retreats, I guess? Yeah, I hope he retreats. Yeah. That's what I'm planning. You do need someone who's able to, like, stop him from going inside the capsule as soon as he goes to work, though. Keep that in mind. Yeah. Uh, I mean, if I give Oifi a javelin, then he might be able to do that. Because mm -hmm. Oifi... Ah, Thief Sword. That's fine, too. <laughs> Wait, you don't want to steal his gold, though. It's okay. Patty can give it back. Besides, I think Oifi's, like, almost capped, so... Okay. Eh. You're right, though. It'd, Stealing it'd, his it'd gold. Be funny is... if he's... I think if you have... Um, say you have 49k, and you steal 5,000k or 5k, then I, I don't think you get the... Uh, I, don't, I don't think they keep the rest of it. I think you just rob them of all their money. Oh, really? And you, and you cap out. Oh, wait. So. Did I remember to put to move fee? Fuck. <laughs> King Travant has joined the battle, has he? Hmm, I suppose I have no choice. My duty as a warrior demands it. Move in on the invaders. <laughs> we'll let them proceed Watch over. Watch retreat now. <laughs> <laughs> I called it. <laughs> Kaka so... really knows how to enter into story and game. <laughs> first he like, first he talks to a bunch of soldiers that aren't there, and then he like move in, and then he runs away. Hannibal makes no sense. What an absolute plot hole. Yeah. Right. For, for, yeah. Like, for most casual players, it will happen exactly as it's supposed to be, but when you like already know in advance what's going to happen, you play around it, shit like that can happen. <laughs> mm -hmm. Jesus Christ. So yeah, now comes Travon's squad, which is a little harder to deal with, but it's still slight, sort of the same principle. Oh no, money. Fuck. No. I'm gold, no! Rip. I'm bold. I'm bold. I'm bold. I'm bold. <laughs> 
Okay, I'm gonna remember to actually. I don't know. I think I maybe moved Fee actually. Yeah, I think I did. I think you did. I think one of these has a wing clipper. Am I completely wrong in that? No, or you're wrong. The last type was wing clipper guy. These just have like ranged uh, magic swords, which he doesn't really care that much about. But they can double her if she holds the brave lance. Wait, she doesn't have it. Wait, where is your brave lance anyway? Did you not sell it? Because I thought I thought Finn sold it to her or something. That's a very good question. I think it might be in the pawn shop. No, yeah, that's funny. Well, still not still still do fine, I think. I think she'll be fine. Like she but just needs aren't to just using this turn with Selif. Oh yeah. So she, basically, she's just, she's just getting the village. <laughs> well, actually, actually, <laughs> actually, I might not. I might not. We'll see. Are you gonna decide like right after? I I, I, I don't know. Like I might he might, might proc Pavice. Mm, but you're not the that rebels. Lucky. The rebels are already here. Blast! We aren't ready for this. <laughs> yeah. What was that about an impregnable fortress? These. Time? I mean, he was he was bracking to Trafons. <laughs> Yo, okay, never mind. Go. Got him. Got him. King, King Travon, I beg your forgiveness. There we go. Got him. And yeah. Bonk. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like they've been holding a child in the dungeon, Salaf. Who are you? What's the matter? I'm Corporal. I'm General Hannibal's son. And wait! Aren't you Lord Salaf the Liberator? Indeed I am. If I may ask, Corporal, why would Tracia imprison one of their own general's sons? King Travon took me hostage. Papa didn't want to fight your army at all, sir. The king threatened my life to force Papa to fight. Please, sir, please take me to Papa. If Papa knows I'm safe, then he won't have to keep fighting. Please, we gotta save him. I see. Don't worry, I promise we'll find him. Move out, everyone. I pray we'll still be in time to save General Hannibal. Hey. All right. And we will be back later. Bye-bye. See ya. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Tracia. Fellow time travelers. Hi, yeah, we're back in the proper timeline now, and uh, yeah, we just uh, captured the impenetrable castle. I don't know, understand, like, they, Diesler said Lucesio was like an impregnable wall, but we just waltzed right up there and stole Corporal. I mean, he wasn't entirely honest in that conversation with Trafond anyway, so I think it was just bragging. Oh, okay. <laughs> like, he also told him he was very excited, basically, to do what he said with, like, watching Kirpin, and when he's gone, he's like, Ah, uh, fuck it. I don't want to watch kids. I don't want to slaughter people. I want to be a bad guy. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, and now we uh, get one of, like, the last joining units in the second generation. And, oh boy, can't wait to see the basis on a character that joins in Chapter 9. They must be... <laughs> what? To be fair, stats don't matter. It's very true, actually. So, yeah, here's a... Uh, what are you calling? Car Car I, I try to say Kyr Prey, but I always see that way. I'm just waiting for him to be added for heroes, and they'll call him Kyr Kyr Prey. <laughs> I'm just gonna say Corporal. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm Stop so saying Kyr Prayers. So here's Corporal. He is the uh, son of Claude and Sylvia, and he joins as a level one priest, which is pretty hilarious, honestly. Just the XP rank thing. <laughs> I mean, yeah, like he's free XP basically. So uh, yeah, Corporal. He uh, being the son of uh, Claude gives him uh, major Bragi blood. We passed on the Valkyria stuff. Although I don't honestly see us ever using it. Maybe like in the final chapter, if I don't want to load. <laughs> I guess. It can also be used to warp someone, kind of. That's true, castle. actually. It can be used to warp someone to the home castle. It's like a res is res very long-range rescue stuff. It's the most painful warp someone will ever take. <laughs> but luckily, he also comes with the fortify stuff. And that's like, that'll be his ticket to level 30. <laughs> fortify and physic. That, that is what he'll use to just auto level to 30. I mean, he has stats. He has growths, but they don't really matter because he's a priest, and all he will be doing is staff botting, which, you know, he'll do that from level 1 to 30. He'll fight a little bit in the arena if he reaches level 20. He has adepts, so... He's I don't miracle. Know. He's miracle, so yeah, I, I guess he can go through the arena. I think he'll win pretty soundly, actually. Mm -hmm. uh, he'll, he'll kill any magical enemies, that's for sure, because he's probably going to cap his rest. But for yeah, sure. I don't know. I don't know, like, it's kind of hard to give him a star ranking, honestly. I feel like he's completely unnecessary. Like, part of me just wants to give him one star because he comes so late, and all he can do is staff spam, which a lot of our other units can do too. But I think it's probably more fair to just give him a two-star rating because he does have useful utility stats, just like the Fortify, although you could have easily passed them down to someone else, I think. I actually, there might not have been that many kids who could use them, actually, at base. I think Orbel might be the only one who can, but... Yeah, I'll two-star, probably. I don't know. Like, he's just basically 33 levels. <laughs> 29, but yeah, definitely. In the context of, like, a you know, normal, casual playthrough, I would definitely give this guy just easy one-star, because there's nothing 
There's no reason to use him. He's not better than anyone else. He doesn't have any kind of niche that anyone else has, unless you count the Valkyrie staff, but even that is not unique to him. Uh, someone else could use it. Uh, Set could use it if you pass down it to him. Um, his res is good, like you said, but that's like the only thing that really stands out about him. I guess his staff rank is pretty good. Um, if you don't pair Sylvia, you get uh, Charlo instead, and he can have the Berserk staff. That's kind of a niche that could be useful. Yeah. Um, that makes some people think that Charlo is better because he also has Paragon, but I don't think you need Paragon on this kind of a unit to reach level 30 in rank runs, so I personally don't value that very much. I can see why it's better than a casual playthrough, but I honestly don't think it matters much. Because they're also super fluid. You, you have so many of these kind of units, except they're all better with more magic and better ranks and better stuff. And this guy can't attack, and it takes 19 levels before he can like get arena money. It sucks. Mm -hmm. it sucks. So this guy fucking sucks. Um, but I can't think of any other like one-star units in this game, so I'll just give him one star. Wow. <laughs> but, okay. Like for the for, for the purpose of the rank run, it's nice that you don't have to do anything with him, but. He, you also don't have to do anything with him. I can't really give someone a good rating for not having to do anything. You know? Yeah, right. <laughs> like he's like completely. He's so the things he can do is get to level thirty. That's something he does to himself. Doesn't really help me complete the game in any way. No, no, no. That's very true. Um, in FE five, he like in FE five where like you need multiple staff users, he'd be good. Yes. But in this yeah. game, because. You know, he doesn't this guy really is also really good in FE5. He gives you the warp stuff. <laughs> <laughs> he does. That's true. I didn't think about that. Yeah, that's true. Actually, I thought about that earlier. This is like the castle you come down to at, in Tracia, isn't it? Yes. It's not um, the terrain doesn't completely match it, but it's. I think like here it is, is the where same mountain range, yeah. Yeah, but I think here is where like Finn and Staffy start start out. I think so, yeah. And then it's like there's an arena in Tracia that's not here normally. That's like meant to be inside Capathogia, I think. I don't know. No room for a gauntlet there. No room for gauntlets. So, what I'm gonna do now is we need to block Hannibal. Uh, I'm thinking Arthur can probably just like, cruise ahead and deal with the Granville reinforcements that show up later. Uh, sure. I think they show up when you, like, recruit or kill Hannibal. Ooh, let's steal this guy's money. Uh, sure, but don't you want to kill him this turn? I see a 46 hit. Empathize. <laughs> my lord Hannibal is depending on me to defend this castle. If you wish to claim it, you must first claim my life. I don't know. Right. We'll probably crit Then so perish. See, there we go. <laughs> wow. Get the crit through 46 <laughs> hit. Empathize. Okay. Oof. And then right, I'll thanks. just then I'll just like equip uh, an armor slayer or something. <laughs> to get a crit. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Are you sure he won't die? Ah. I mean, like, I know Hannibal doesn't attack, but I, I don't. 36. Know he'll he'll, he'll oh, yeah, be he's fine. Okay. He'll be fine. So I'm thinking the horse units. Okay, so here's the thing. How many units do you think we need left at home to defend against Trevon's squad? Well, um, in theory, it's one set. <laughs> but yeah. You could do, also do it more elaborately. And I think you should because it's half your keys, like every bit of XP you can get on him. So, yeah. We could also send I, Patty I, down to have some fun. Like, she's probably dodgy enough to the point where she can just steal all the money from the squad. Uh, the question is, do we really need the money? I, I Honestly, it would be nice to get some money on, on Patty. She's yeah, just get her money back so she can Paragon next chapter again. And, like, give money to anyone who needs it. Like, uh, I actually... Oh, sure, Corporal needs money, actually. Yeah, and, and I, so want to, uh, I want to keep Leaf around. Yeah, that's fine. Like, <laughs> just killing Travon with him could be fun. Yeah, that's what I want to see, and he's actually not bad against Travant either. No, he quadruples him with the rainbow and kills him. It's pretty goddamn good. So, uh, also, I want to show you guys something, because I think, uh, no, okay. Oh, uh, Julia, yeah. I want to show, actually, I think Ulster's, like, yeah, falling in love with someone else. I think, <laughs> see? I think... Oh, shit. Yeah, he likes Bana. <laughs> but... Well, Bana falls in love with someone else, yeah. Then. Yeah, so people have been saying that, like, oh, Julia never builds love points, but I checked earlier. If, I send... if you send Julia into the castle now... The old guy will tell her that she has feelings for Ulster. So you can, Julia can get a lover. It just takes a long time. You can um, put her on the tile, where you like move into the castle after you warp, and then that way you can show it next turn. Ah, yeah, I could do that, but it's not that big deal. So yeah, I'll keep, uh, we, we'll keep setting around. Julia, however, will just warp a lot for the time yeah. being. Uh, I do kind of want to go and repair the warp stuff at some point. Yeah. Well, again, you can go on the tile and go inside to repair it without losing a turn of warping, so that's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was thinking about that, yeah. And uh, But yeah, you think the squad that's here, do you think they're left, they're, they can take on Travon's squad safely? Okay, so in a casual playthrough, I sometimes send one of these down to the castle Hannibal's at to defend it. Then again, Hannibal can defend it himself, so that's not going to point. I think they're, it's easier to just have them here and ready to warp than mm -hmm. to try and move them anywhere else. They're not going to get anywhere fast. So I just keep them here. And this way you can also like get kills on Favon and Joel here. 
Yeah, I think that probably works out pretty well. Um, like, Ulster and Arsai, they doesn't matter where to go, because we don't want to take kills, because they, they get too much XP. Unless <laughs> 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 that is. Yeah, no, you're right. But yeah, I could dance I'll... for Julia to get another warfare. Oh yeah, I could dance for her. Yeah, you're right, you're right. I could do that. Julia, uh, lean good down here. Get down, girl. Ranked run, everyone. Come on, get down. Here we go. And then I'll warp home someone who hasn't moved yet, so they can move back in. I mean, I suppose I could... I don't know. I'll, I'll, I'll expand the warp stuff before I repair it. There's surely someone else who also needs to needs to warp stuff, I think. Something else you could do with like these turns of like nothing happening is uh, try to get Sylvia into a miracle range for the arena. Ooh, how, and how would I do that? Well, you, you see if she wins the arena. If she doesn't win and ends up at 1 HP, you keep her in the castle or like heal her until she's at the right HP to take on the arena opponents with Miracle. That's not a bad idea. Yeah, she does have to be indoors for that though, so you have to like put Julia inside too. Yeah, alright, well, uh, time to, uh, well, this is what we're gonna do with, with, with Corporal a lot. You almost might as well just spam Fortify with him. You're gonna give him money anyway. Mm, I guess, but like, why not use the physic when it's only one guy? I mean, he gets almost as much from that. Almost. Does he? I don't know what the difference I think Corp is. I actually, I think Fortify is like 80, but yeah. Yeah, it's, it's 85 actually, I don't know that. Mm -hmm. It's a ridiculous amount. And he does have 30 levels to go. So, do we send Nana after these guys, or what do you what do you say? Uh, yeah, at least I would like to return Aris to the home castle at some point. Oh, point. sure, I don't even know why I sent Aris down there, to be honest. Oh, well, he, we needed his help to kill enemies. <laughs> and he has the Paragon ban. Yeah, I mean, honestly, we could kill the boss with Aris if you want. Yeah, I like that. If Hannibal doesn't do anything, that's great. Oh, shit. Well, yeah, or if you well, might, or might, or might kill the boss, we'll see what Don't he does. Don't worry about Aris' level. Oh, okay, okay. nice. Oh, he's dead. Oh, whoops. <laughs> nope. Uh-oh. I'm so sorry. Well, that's a bit annoying. I guess we can warp him home and have him kill a couple of Wyverns then. It's not like he's going to get Aris. any experience. Yeah, Aris, right? Like, is he going to get any experience anywhere else on the map? Uh, you could have him fight the ballistas along with Seleph. Unless you want mm -hmm. Seleph to like seize it as soon as he can. Like, I don't know, I yeah. feel like you have enough people at the home castle to kill Wyverns, but he just be, I I forgot just be taking XP from like Johalvier and friends. Ah, uh, yeah, you're right. This experience is best left to them, yeah. Hey, by like, the way... Again, Aris you... is gonna like sweep the final chapters, so... Do you know if Travant retreats to get reinforcements on this map? Uh, I've never seen him do it, but it doesn't mean he, don't, he won't. But he seems like the type who doesn't do it. Like, imagine him saying his farewell to, like, Arion and then coming back yeah. to actually any more, any more reinforcements. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't all that long ago that the region here was was under House Leonster's rule. Oh, what a peaceful time that was. As soon as the last war was over, though, the Thracian pounced on us like a starving cat. So does she need all these villages? Who else? But the, does she cap out with, like... I feel like she should have a lot of gold. Uh, maybe? I mean, no, she's really low, actually. We, uh, I'll, I'll check. I'll, I, I remember us doing something to like toss Probably her money away. Probably repaired or something. I, don't I know. think we, I think we did. Uh, actually, the brave lance isn't on her. I remember now. No, it's not. And uh, also, she has sixteen thousand. So she, let's just give her. Yeah, a little okay, it's fine. It's and Selif, honestly, he can just go down here. Yeah. Yeah, it'd be really convenient to send Corporal up to get those villages, but he would just get overrun by the reinforcements. Yeah, I don't. Actually, I don't why don't like we that. have like Eris and Arthur? Like, take on reinforcements together. That's probably more HP for uh, Aris. Sure, sure, we can do that. I just you, really you can also wait, 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 wait. Before you do this, you can actually this turn you can return him and, and warp, warp him, him yeah. to yeah. I agree. That's that's, that's a better. great idea. Let's do that. Much better. There we go, and then we can even dance for him so he gets to move too. Yeah. There we go. Uh, and then is Julia we'll... inside right now? No, right. Ah, uh, Julia is. Not inside, so what okay, we do... So he has to go outside first. Yeah, we go outside. outside. First, we promote him. Yee. There we go. Working hard. He has been working very hard. Did we just keep the Paragon ban on him? I think we do. Yeah, like, who, who would you even sell it to, right? I mean, I guess someone who's, like, gonna fight Draco Knights now, but no, fuck it. I can't be bothered. That'll <laughs> 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 be fine. Yeah. Like, people Pat like the only and, one. and, like, Pat is the only one. you're not gonna kill that much. No, not to warrant the Paragon ban. Yay. Hey, now he has more skill again than whoever else that was that Dermot. had more skill than him. Yeah, Dermot. Actually, he's... Yeah, it's only like two points above him, but... You can repair the Missile thing. It's with 17 uses. I like, it's Paragon Bat already, so... Pretty yeah, for sure. Now. All right, well... I have no money. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you can so... give him money now if you want to. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, I although can. Although, doesn't have much right now. She nah, just nah, I don't want to do that. Is he, right. is he in love with Lini yet? Jesus Christ. <laughs> I don't think he is, he, he wouldn't would be able to give her gold if he was. So, 
Yeah. I don't know why. I thought they'd fall in love way sooner. Anyway, so what I'm gonna do with Patty now is I'm gonna keep her out of range of Travant, obviously. Well, you don't even have to. Well, I guess Travant does have Adip, I think, but she has like defense to take a hit, I think. Hmm, you're right. Oh, wait, she doesn't have, does she have Alex? Yes, he's a cost, right? Uh, he has pursuit. He has pursuit. Yeah. Uh, nihil yeah. and vantage. So he he won't hit her twice. Oh, yeah. But he will do forty nine damage, which is a yeah. lot. Uh, yeah, she, but it's not she actually to kill her. she takes it. But yeah. Here's the question though. Eighty six hit. She'll have. Oh wow. She'll actually have eighty three. So they'll have one percent hit against her. <laughs> Easy. Three percent hit actually. Actually no, they'll have more because of weapon triangle. Okay, but you can also put. Um, I don't actually know who you can put there. I think both charisma users are gone. So never mind. Yeah, I mean, she doesn't get a sibling bonus. I never... I think that's a 10% no, away. That's good. Mm. I think I keep looking it up like every episode. I think it's just good. I mean, I'm not gonna lie. Also, okay. also, Actually, they like using ranged javelins, I think. I don't think they have one range weapons, right, these guys? Yeah. yeah. So they might just prioritize using range, and then they won't be able to hit her, because that's... Travon goes like, last, so... Mm -hmm. hmm. Honestly, oh, she has soul. Even, even yeah, she has soul. Like she's gonna be fine. You know what? Fuck it. Let's go. Let's go. I, I gave her the brave sword with crit on it. <laughs> Shit. Well, it's very useful right now. I like how you gave her the two best weapons in the game. I on a unit that hasn't even like fought anything yet. <laughs> there we go. I wish I could dance for Julia as well, but I can't. Not like this. Uh, yeah, only to have in a position where you could have. No, there was no way, because Iris needed to move first, and he's the one with Kento. True. Okay, so the next warp we do needs to be a Kanto warp. Kanto warp? Mm hmm. Oh, yeah, I see what you mean. Yeah, I was like, huh. Oh, I see. I see. I see. You taught me that. Yeah, uh, but I was like, I never heard your expression Kanto warp before. No, I made it up. I made it up right now, but. Yeah, still. you made it up because you want to sound smarter than you are. Hey. I am smarter than I am. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Hey, it's about time. Yay. Yay. So what do we do with... Uh, do you want to send him... Do we want to like, warp him eventually too, or...? Eventually, maybe, yeah. I mean, there's going to be like one Dragonite squad that ends up at this castle later. So yeah, it's, it's yeah, the tree the tree headed Hydra attack or whatever it's called. Yeah, That's the three headed should... dumb attack. The upper water wyverns, that one. <laughs> It's that's fantastic design. Yeah, I mean, like, honestly, it, 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 it scared me a lot when it initially happened, though. Of course. So right, so dragon if, scary when or you if he will just stay here, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> Equip the thief sword just in case Hannibal goes crazy. It's <laughs> <laughs> funny. All right, so I guess yeah, Aris will, Aris will go up here then. Although we He's want to keep him a little bit far because the, the re I think the reinforcements comes here. Yeah, they have like 40 attack with like silver weapons. They're I think not... they come after you take the castle, right? Or after you recruit yeah, Hannibal. Yeah, after that castle turns blue, which happens both when you seize it and when you like kill Hannibal. Or like yeah, when you yeah, recruit yeah. Hannibal. So, I don't uh, know if killing Hannibal works. So we... Yeah, so we definitely... Yeah, no, I think if you kill him, you gotta seize it the good old-fashioned way, yeah. Alright, here we go!